Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another, yeah, another, I know, Binding of Isaac in-depth video. It's four in the past, like, 72 hours. It's a little bit ridiculous, but look, we have something, uh, kind of a follow-up to last video where we looked at the, what I deemed as the secret floor, uh, in Isaac. There's actually a couple of them. Uh, and we're just gonna go to one of the really awesome ones today. Uh, I do want to give a shout out to Final Shade on the Discord, uh, or Alexander Richmond on YouTube, who kind of enlightened me about this. Uh, I'm gonna leave a link to his videos in the description down below. Go check those out, show him some love, because this is some pretty whack stuff. Uh, I had no idea that this was in the game, and if you thought that last video was weird, this one's even weirder. So we're just going to hop in as Isaac. Uh, and then, as always, we're going to need the debug console. So we're going to go to stage 10. And as you can see, stage 10 is going to take us to Sheil. Oh, we can go to Sheil. Fantastic. Uh, we can do stage 10A. That takes us to the cathedral. But you could do stage 10B. Uh, and that takes us to the dark room, which uh, is a little bit strange that it would do that. There's also no music going on right- Oh, there is music. Never mind. There's music. But let's give ourselves some items here. I'm just gonna do like a normal soy milk, uh, Libra, and Sacred Heart just to, uh, make sure we can clear these rooms relatively quickly. We're gonna- Why- Why did you not do the things you normally do? Pardon me? Did really- Did Sacred Heart really mess up, uh, soy milk Libra that much? Apparently so. That's very strange. Uh, anyway, we gotta clear out this floor, and then we will, uh, we'll be able to use Teleport 2.0 to get to an error room on this floor, and then upon getting to an error room on this floor, we'll get teleported to a secret floor that legitimately has a secret name. Uh, and the link, the title of the video should tell you exactly what it is. Uh, but this is some really wacky stuff, and it confirms our our suspicion that the secret floor that we saw in the last in-depth video uh, is actually some green mode layouts. And a lot of you told me, you were like, Tyler, uh, it's pretty straightforward, dude. Those are for sure green mode layouts. And I, I'm aware of that, but it still doesn't answer the question of why they would keep this even in the game. And I'm not saying that there's some weird ARG going on, but it's a little bit strange that they would keep these in the game, uh, not document them. You know, removing this kind of stuff, you know, as somebody who does coding and does uh, some stuff here, I'm just going to do a quick debug. What's infinite HP? Debug 3. And you know what? We'll just stick debug 10 on as well. Uh, and that's going to auto-kill everything. Let me give myself uh, a heart here. So we can just walk in here. We got to go into every room. We'll also give ourselves uh, teleport 2.0 here. And we'll also slap debug 8 on there for infinite item charges. I suppose we could literally just do this uh, for the rest of the time here. Until we clear every single room. I know it's tedious. Uh, and really this is just me sitting here being a bit of a dweeb by making you all think uh, this is going to be some fantastically awesome thing and the suspense is killing you. It's not actually going to be all that fantastic, but it's still insanely interesting. I I I'm... A little bit shocked and stunned that this is in the game to the extent that this is in the game because I understood the uh, the weird floor we saw last time being in the game is just something that didn't take out this one it's like they genuinely wanted us to know that this is in here and I don't that was actually super dope uh, I don't exactly know how how they would have expected us to find this I mean this is a very obscure thing to have to do here to uh, go into go into a floor that doesn't exist and then do an error room from there. Uh, it's very, very, very strange. So there's our devil deal. When we pop this again, we're now on to our error room. And then when we go up from here, it's going to take us to a new floor. And this new floor is special rooms greed. So there you go. Uh, and this is literally similar to how it was in the last video. These are legitimate greed layouts in these rooms. It's not just blank rooms. These are greed layouts complete with the damn button. Uh, and there's no way to get out of here unless you hit the button and the button hurts you. 
So it, it genuinely is literally green mode layouts here, which is so cool. I mean, this is such a random uh, little Easter egg in the game to find. It's, it's just very, very strange. So we can go through all these uh, rooms here. I don't believe any enemies spawn, uh, unless you maybe hit the button, but even then, I don't think any enemies spawn uh, still. But how this was useful for uh, debugging and testing, I got no idea. I I'm not a developer of Isaac. I'm sure it was maybe interesting to see all of their different floor layouts and stuff like that. Why they kept it in the game, once again, I have no idea, but you can't deny uh, it's still pretty damn cool. So what I do want to do, I want to go everywhere there is to go. There's a fallen fight in here, okay? I want to use Teleport 2.0 some more, just because I haven't tested to see... Oh, well, there are secret rooms on this floor. Uh, I haven't tested to see what happens if you use... So there's a Devil Deal. What happens if you get an error room on this floor? So we've seen every room, we pop this, it just takes us back to the devil deal. So there is no more error room, uh, this is as far as we can go. That's the secret floor. Insanely neat stuff, uh, we'll be back with more mod spotlights in the next video. Some of you I know enjoyed the 4 in-depth Isaac uh, in 80 hours or whatever the hell it was that we did. This weekend will be a fun special Isaac. Uh, and Mod Spotlights will continue back up. Thank you guys for watching. If you did enjoy, slap that like button. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't, uh, aren't following the channel and all that good stuff. We'll be pumping out more content soon. In-depth is cool. I enjoy making these videos. Uh, and we'll definitely be doing more in the near future. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.